Alright, welcome back to Dead Rising 2, um, where we're about to get bombarded with cutscenes, I think. Let's see, cutscenes? Yep. Oh boy, where's TK going? Huh, where are you going, TK? Oh. Oh boy. I believe that's called karma. Oh yeah, so... The uh, Zombrex that I've been saving pretty much this entire game was, was for TK. Next thing I was coming to, looking at you. You must have gotten loose somehow. Uh, I can't believe you got the better of me. Well, I can tell you right now, that isn't gonna happen. You gotta get me Zombrex, Chucky. And you gotta move. If you don't give him Zombrex, you don't get overtime mode. So. Let them tear each other to pieces. He hasn't turned yet. Why? Some people are just more resistant to the infection than others. Well, that's convenient. I can set you free, man. You gotta help me. How long does he have? I don't think we'll know until he turns, Chuck. Hmm, I don't trust that Sullivan. But yeah, um, like I said, if you don't give TK some Zombrex, you won't get the, um... You'll be able to finish the game, you just won't get the best ending. Why do they keep using this character model? I've saved this guy. This guy's died in about three cutscenes. And now he's a news anchor. Want to bet? Hey, we simply need to go out there and take control. Go out there? Are you out of your mind? Look, let's just try and stay calm and think our way out of this. I did not work this hard just to get blasted off this rock. That's what she said. They'll come get me. Hell, they'll come get everyone. This is the story of the century. Well, no one's gonna hear it unless we get the hell out of here. There's more going on here. Just a heist. First the gas, and now this. We know TK framed Chuck and started the outbreak, but Doi? there's Doi? no way he could access the media with that lie that we're all dead. And he couldn't order a military firebombing. This is bigger than TK. Way bigger. Look, I know we've all been through a lot in the past few days, but don't go making it worse and start making things. All right, Sully. Seriously, what are you doing? He was the one that convinced us that there was going to be a firebombing, and now he's like, No, there's not going to be a firebombing. We're all fine. I don't trust that Sullivan. Yeah, no, you're not. You take it easy for a while. You've got your story. Don't go losing your head over this. Hmm. Certainly wouldn't want that. So yeah, we gotta go down into the maintenance stuff. Really? Not not gonna have me save. So anyway, I'll meet you back in the um maintenance tunnels. See you then. Alright, here we are at the maintenance tunnel. 
Um, I would cut ahead to when we get to where we want to go to, but some pretty interesting stuff happens here in the underground. And uh, I figured I'd show, because it is pretty cool, actually. Just some odd goings-on with the zombies. See, uh, I'm not too sure why they introduced the gas zombies, because they're just super annoying, really. And that's pretty much all they're good for, is just being annoying. Everyone out of my way. Alright, it looks like it wants me to go this way. What is that? A cement saw? Yeah, I'm not picking that up. Oh boy. There are lots of them here. Let's uh, get in this thing. Of course there's a train blocking me. Oh, this is where I did that one mission. Alright, cool. Because I don't know why they had me go through like the North Plaza and stuff when there's a maintenance... Or like an underground hatch, like right there pretty much. Now see, if you'll notice, all of the zombies are, they're pretty much like just walking in one direction. Oh god. Yeah, that's not good. Um, they're all heading towards actually where we want to go to also. So yeah, pretty weird stuff going on here. They, I don't think they'll attack you unless you, um, like go really close to them or whatever. Or run them down like I'm doing. But, um... Yeah, it's pretty interesting. I like that they're... They've kind of, like, got a mission. Almost. They're just... They're all going to the same place. We'll find out why in a second, but... I think you can kind of figure it out if you have played the games or... Seen the cutscenes or whatever. Alright, how far away... Wow, I've killed a lot of zombies. Alright, here we are. This is where they all want to go to. Is it? Yeah, it is. Some pretty weird shenanigans going on. Wait, how did he get in? Did he have the code? That's some really crappy security they got going on there. I don't know if it was intentional or not, but the gas zombies look almost identical to smokers in um, Left 4 Dead. I mean, it had to have been on purpose, because you don't do that by accident. I think they look like a combination of the Tyrant from Resident Evil and Smokers from Left 4 Dead. Which is a pretty weird combination. So they got that like heart thing that the um, Tyrants have. I like how Chuck is just chilling with the zombies. That is a very good question, Chuck. Hmm, looks like they're harvesting queens. Yes, you actually can pick that weapon up, and it's awesome. 
How does no one see Chuck? He's standing in the middle of the room. Seriously, how does no one see him? There we go, finally. My god, I was gonna have to say, these guys are pretty dumb. Alright, so... This is a fun mission. This is actually probably one of my favorites, just because it brings you to a place where... You know, you, you'd never thought in a Dead Rising game you'd be in like some like underground lab. Come on, that's not cool. Again, not cool. And yeah, there's a bunch of these guys here. You just gotta kill them. Same as TK's goons. You just keep wailing on them, pretty much. Whoa, that guy went far. <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy just keep kicking this guy. Why'd you drop down? No, not cool. There we go. Is that all of them? I don't think so. Um, where's the other guy? What is this? A machete? Yeah, I don't want that. Are there any more? I don't think so. Alright, where's this telling me to go? This reminds me of an area in Resident Evil 5. For whatever reason, I don't know. What is that noise? That's weird. It's some like weird squishing noise whenever uh, Chuck runs. Alright. Let's find out who's behind this. Oh, it's just two geeks. You should call the doctor and let him know that we're going to start preparing the harvest for shipping. Yeah, things are going just as predicted. Absorption of the compound is at 80% of ideal, and maturation rates are 10 times normal. The harvest is going important. Why does no one ever just. <laughs> No one ever notices Chuck. So yeah, even though these guys aren't crazy, they technically count as psychopaths, which is just really weird. Apparently if you stand in the middle of them, you can just get both of them at the same time. Alright, so let's get these guys, these jerks, these poindexters as Chuck pointed out. Easiest psychopath uh, boss fight ever of all time. Phenotrans? Oh, you bastards. Hmm. This is great, I love this. Thanks for the coffee. <laughs> That's so stupid, but Chuck makes it so badass. Chuck is a total bamf. Please tell me I can save. Oh, you bastards. Alright, anyway, um... That's good enough for this video. So, I will see you next time.